Saquon Barkley, running back 32, 162 rush attempts, 593 yards, two touchdowns, 41 receptions, 57 targets, 263 yards through the air, and two touchdowns. Guys, your thoughts on Saquon Barkley? Before Kevin gets in and gives a pretty good and accurate representation of Saquon Barkley, uh, I was burned hard. I don't think there was anybody who was higher on Saquon Barkley last year than, than me, and I was burned hard by him and uh to the point where i was stubborn enough to like hang on to him for a lot longer than i should have and tried to ride that train out just to prove myself right uh so for no reason other than i'm personally pissed off at myself and his performance last year i will not be touching saquon barkley this year even if he is the best available player when it comes for my team to draft uh, Saquon Barkley will get overlooked. I, I'm not believing it. Part of it's the Giants' offense, right? Now, uh, we might be seeing a bit of a change now that Joe Judge is out of there and then we're going to be changing offensive philosophies. But they're coming into this team. Saquon's not their guy. Daniel Jones isn't their guy. Kenny Galladay's not their guy. Like, none of these are, are their guy. So I'm not very high on this offense. It, it could be one of, if not the worst offenses in the league this coming season. But Saquon, he looks slow, guys. And and I'm thinking maybe this offseason we'll see a lot of hype as training camp rolls around. Barkley looks like his old self, and he's got his burst back and everything else. Like, I – Barkley is a guy that I am staying away from at all costs. He is – Health adverse, you know, the phrase that Alex used earlier. And I'm just going to go other directions. I I would rather skip it and be wrong than pick him and be right about the fact that he's going to fail miserably. Like, I haven't worked on running back rankings yet. I don't think he's going to be my top 12 this year. Like, I just don't see it happening for him. Like, this is kind of in in name only. So, he's, he's... He's an RB2, and and he's a shaky RB2 because he hasn't proven to be healthy the last two seasons. So buyer beware, but he is not a guy that I'm going after under any circumstances whatsoever. And Saquon wasn't even in my top 12 last year going into the redraft and um, took some heat on that one for sure and felt, uh, you know, it definitely kind of proved out there when it was all said and done. And I don't see anything really changing on this one, right? The analysis still holds true, very similar to what I was saying last year. Yeah, you know, even if he stays healthy, even if he plays the full year, I don't know that we are going to see much. Uh, we're going to see some more production, but I don't know that we're going to drastically see a huge turnaround here. I just don't see that one happening. 